Welcome back. It's been a few days since I vlogged, um, but we've been very, very busy here. And we opened the show in, I want to say, five days from now. So we still have a lot to work to do before we open. And I just want to bring you along for the journey. We are doing costume fittings today. We've got parade rehearsal. We have a tuck run. And we are working with the black tracks. Is that what it's called? Black tracks. Yeah. Yeah. We're working with the black tracks today which is basically the the um software or the way that we can skate with spotlights and not have spotlighters so here's midori's antenna <laughs> <laughs> she has to wear this through her hair but basically we wear our black tracks in our costumes it's very cool but basically the lights are programmed with it to follow the movement um but it will take some getting used to thank you mm -hmm. So that's what we're about to do now. We gotta head to Studio B. I kind of simulated show hair a little bit for costume fittings later. Sarah is here. I've really been enjoying her company and having the opportunity to work with her. So that has been really fun. And I'm just, I'm very, very excited to open. Cast 2 had their closing show last night, which was bittersweet, you know, it's emotional, but I'm excited to get started. So here we go. Here we go. This one is stringer, and then it's the beacon. And this works with like it will follow, it will track you all the time. This is very important because um, it will track you every every time. If you can check this one with the with the light on, it's it, like a little red. Yeah, yeah. There's like a little red eyeball in there. Okay. Uh, put in your costume because if it's hidden in your costume, it will not it will not track you. And yeah, this takes a little bit of a learning curve. It may get a little chaotic just to stay calm, stay organized. Um, M3 and F3, M4 and F4, M, M and F5. Summer is green, fall is orange, and winter is blue. So that will also help you. This should be in show order. It helps you to understand the order of it. Black tracks on. None of us have any idea what's going on, but we're just we're we're, we're starting anyway. Finale. <laughs> so comfortable. Anybody in finale? If you right on, right on, coming through. Okay. Here's our beacon. Stuck her on in, and then I have to wear this around my waist or basically anywhere around my core that won't slide down. Two, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, press six, seven. When she does this movement of, come on, come on, it's like they're your friends. 
they should be your friend. So, so it's like I'm an alien. It's like hey, it is nearly time for warm up ice. We did finish with the black tracks. We worked on Game of Thrones, cleaning a little bit. Fall they worked on, and also opening. So that is all done with. Now they're just making the ice, and I have first warm up with Madison, Dasha, and Gleb. So we do have a tech run today. So I need to warm up all of my jumps and just go over patterns before we have the run at, I wanna say it's at two o'clock. Not 100% there, but that sounds about right. before notes at 1.30. So, mm. just made a salad with some quinoa, eggs, corn, carrots, cucumber, black olives, and some peppers. We just did a little bit of notes. It is 1.49 and we have 11 minutes until go time for our tech run. Our presets. Hi, Elio. Ready to go. <laughs> Ready to go. We don't really have any presets yet because we don't have costumes. We have costume fittings today, however, we were able to preset our black tracks, so this is my decided seat for stage left. And then the other one is on stage right. We are just about ready, and I'm excited. We're doing lights, and I think Cast 2 is coming to watch. Hi! <laughs> How are you feeling? <laughs> excited? Nervous? Uh... I don't know. I Clearly you're finish. excited. You already have your skates on. <laughs> I just want to finish and open the show. Yeah. A few more days. A few yeah, more so days. Excited. Joanna did my preset for me. <laughs> Emojis are preset. Here we go. It's happening. It's happening. <laughs> it is happening. Oh my god. Yeah, it's a video vlog. Today we're doing tech run with light. Uh, what else? Are we gonna be world famous? You already you are, Alien. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Stand, Stand by. Standing by. I'm 
my camera's rolling. I have too much with too much it's stuff okay. with me. I don't know if you were there when it happened, but I put my skate on and the lump that I have traveled up my leg. Huh? What do you mean? I have a lump uh -huh. from my skate. Yeah. When I put my skate, and that's why my foot always hurts so bad with uh -huh. my skate. And then I put my skate on today and noticed that the, the bump went up to my, up here. That's why it didn't. Shifted. Yeah. Huh. When I put my skate on, it shifted up. And that's why it doesn't hurt as bad because it's like, it's still there, but it's higher. So it's, it's almost like something is living in there. Yeah, something is not right. In my there's, there's an alien in your body. <laughs> Shall we go on? How was tech run for you? We did it. I mean, no one died. It, it happened. Yeah. It happened. But the black truck, changing black trucks and changing costumes and the lighting was so different. Lighting was so different. And when I jump in the solo, both mm. jumps are into the corner directly towards my spotlight. Mm. And the ice is dark, so it's it's so disorienting. Yeah. It's an adjustment, but... Oh, and also my skirt is so long. Your skirt is so long. They should so shorten that. When we did the lift with Piotr, it went over his face. So his face was covered. I was on his shoulder and yeah. I saw his like face was covered. So I was like, are you okay? And then he goes, whoosh! He literally like put me back in his shoulder. And then we did the spin. I'm like, I'm screaming. I saw the shift on the video, but I didn't know what happened. And Tech run, honestly though, aside from the, the spotlights being a little bit disorienting because it's, it's brand new. It's the first time we've done it with all the spots in the black track. It went quite well, I would say. I haven't done any costumes yet. I just did the cape for Game of Thrones and we got the lift up, so two thumbs up there, but I feel drained now. According to my Apple Watch, I burned 400 calories in that tech run without costume changes, but we did have cast two watching, which was nice. So I'm, um, I'm very happy actually with how the tech run went and I was giving it like 200% for sure. We're definitely getting there. I'm feeling pretty confident about opening in a few days and very, very excited, but I am drained now and we don't have time to relax. We have parade rehearsal, so I have to change into my uniform because we are we are laying out parade on the promenade and we have to be in our blues. And then after that, we have costume fittings. So it's a never ending day. We're here and I have no energy to give. We're dead. We're dead. It's, uh, it's parade, which always a joy, but we're tired. <laughs> Go Pirates! Oh, are we going? I think it's our time to go. which I didn't even realize. Yeah. Yeah. Is she good? Yes. Okay. 
Jordan, that top wow. is awesome. It's actually so comfortable. Yeah, I thought so it was mine. Be, like not very stretchy, but the, there's a bit of give like bent here, elastic. Fantastic. So cute. You you look so cute. <laughs> so do you. We're so cute. I think it would be so interesting to have someone that yeah. No how to I'm all finished with costume fittings. I am so excited about the costumes. They are so cute, and I've never had costumes that are this brand new. So, very exciting to be the third person to wear these costumes. Um, <clears throat> and honestly, like, there isn't too many adjustments needed because the girl I'm replacing, her and I are pretty similar in size. She's a little bit taller than me, which is a shock to no one. But yeah, like, aside from a hem, like, everything else fits really good. And I'm... I'm so excited to try them out. So we have another tech run tomorrow and then I'm not sure if the costumes will be ready, but we'll see. Once it's like all set in stone, I can show you more in depth and like close up, you know what I mean? Anyways, I'm gonna go to dinner now. I'm starving. It's been such a hectic day, but we're finally done and it's 6.15. So off to the mess we go. Hopefully there's some, some good food to eat there. Here we go! <laughs> Mess! <laughs> Disclaimer before anyone comes and attacks me, I decided to eat chicken again because I need more protein during install, so I've been eating chicken. Um, but I'm pretty happy with the selection in the mess today. So I've got some chicken, I made a little salad, there's quinoa, which is phenomenal, and spinach tart. Mm -hmm. And then for dressing, I've just been doing olive oil for my salads. Um, but it's a lettuceless salad because I ran out of space. And then they had these like cookies in a cup thing. So I've already grabbed dessert before I even <laughs> made my dinner plate. I had such a chill night. It was really, really great actually. I just watched the breakup. I had a Coke Zero. And I did a little bit of editing. It's definitely time for some well-deserved sleep. It has just been a day of go, 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 but very eventful day nonetheless. My hair from my braids kind of looks crazy, but yeah, tomorrow's another another busy one. So it is a C day, and we don't really start until I want to say 3 o'clock, but it will be a show hair and makeup day, which is fun. I feel like I haven't looked presentable <laughs> since I got on board, so I'm going to get some sleep. And I'll see you guys bright and early. Tomorrow is my last day in this cabin. It is nearing four o'clock. Today we add a few layers to our tech run and I'm really excited. So I did my show hair and makeup simulation. I still have to do lips and lashes, but our run isn't till 9.30 tonight. So I figured I could wait on those, but this morning, even though we didn't have anything on the schedule, I was very, very busy. I did a lot of editing. I have been doing laundry and also trying to clean up the cabin a bit because we do move cabins tomorrow. I do need to head to Studio B. We have presets at four o'clock. I did also pick up a few of my costumes that were ready to go that I need for today's run. So I just swung by the conference center. I hit the jackpot with costumers. I have Jade. She's awesome and she's taking very good care of my costume. So I picked up my opening costume is all set and my cape for Game of Thrones. That's basically all we need to use today for the run. And then I have to also practice with my backpack thing for the summer section. So, um, yeah. I'm gonna pack a little snack to have before we jump on the ice. I have yet to try a single thing from First Form I don't love. So I will have these linked below. They're so delicious. I also have the mint cookie flavor or like chocolate mint cookie. So, so, so good. We are preparing for 
about the run through dress run. Not all costumes are ready yet, but <laughs> we are ready. <laughs> but, but some costumes. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Mm. It's a video yeah. vlog. <laughs> Okay. And what is this? <laughs> That's for um still gets a little bit of the outside noise, but not as much. Better. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> gonna jump nice. They're making the ice right now. And then we gotta get on at 4 30. I've got the Bermuda shorts on, phone in the back pocket, and we're ready to start. And my top matches. New Party. outfits, <laughs> outfit fit check. There you go. So this is gray and the pink. It's looking good. It's always good. <laughs> looking good. <laughs> she is beauty. <laughs> she is grace. <laughs> It is later. We're still in Studio B. It's 7.30 and it's time for warm-up ice. And, um, oh, I'm sorry, Dasha. I have my backpack to try for the beginning of summer. It's very pretty, but it's very, very large. So we'll see how this goes. Luckily, I take this off with the duet, so it's okay. Gleb, you want to give an update to the world? Gentle. This lighting makes me look so pale. I want what? An update to the world. Uh, it's recording now? No, I'm shy. I can't. <laughs> <laughs> no. It is 8.40 and we oh have God. notes at... It's 8.40? It's 8.40. Yes, it's 8.40 p.m. I'm currently chugging an energy drink because we have a, a run at 9.30, so... Um, we're in the hi dressing room. Hi to the world, Gleb. He doesn't. What? What? Say hi to the world. I said hi. Hi. Yeah, we're chilling. I have to put my lipstick on. My body does not want to do a run in an hour. That's for sure. You want to finish? Mm. Oh, no, I just messed it up. Ooh, that's a cool red. That looks so nice on you. Thanks. That's so cool. I have like seven colors in it. I this is my that. favorite I ride or die. This, this is like for, oh wait, liquid catsuit? Yeah. Ah! Yeah, and I got this color and I got this color. I got this one, it's so <laughs> Lipstick's on, it means it's happening. I cut my finger wiping my blades after a warm up. But yeah, we had warm up ice. And now we've got 20 minutes until notes, and then another tech run. Yay! Oh, and Morris, if you're watching this, I'm in your spot that you had on Allure, so miss you. Preset. Yeah.
tonight took a bit of a turn for the worse, unfortunately. Um, he started the tech run, got through opening, everything was going well, but Ilya actually injured himself, something in his bicep. It was, it was really scary. We had to do like a show stop for a bit and he went to medical, so he has to get a few tests done to see the severity of it and honestly like none of us could really focus so much after that it puts things into perspective our job is is quite dangerous like you just never know what's gonna happen and we're all really worried for Ilya so I'm just praying and hoping that he's going to be okay we really don't know what that's gonna mean for the future because we are planning to open on day four of next cruise and today is the last day of this current cruise. So we have three full days left of install before we open the show. Um, so that is pretty much an update on what's going on. It's, it's a huge bummer and it just like, it really hit me hard. So we're just hoping that he's gonna be okay and then he'll be able to stay with us for cast three. So please send some thoughts and good vibes for Ilya. For the rest of the evening, I'm just, finishing up the odds and ends around this cabin since like I mentioned before we are moving cabins so I will show you that process tomorrow. Tomorrow is the first day of our opening cruise so looking forward to that. Don't know what that's gonna mean for cast three with the events that happened today but just going to think positively and hoping for the best for Ilya. Stop of the day. Good old Walmart. I think yeah. I'm gonna get this. Yeah. Yeah. I definitely need a new memory card with all the filming I've been doing. Walmart is beyond overwhelming. Yeah. There's too many things. <laughs> Secured the goods. We're gonna give a haul later. How much did you guys spend? <laughs> I spent like close to two. Like 60. <laughs> we are finished before Matty and Madison shopping because I could have kept shopping in there. Yeah. I could have kept going. It's dangerous in we, there. Yeah, and we had just made it to like the grocery section and then I thought we were the last ones ready, so I got nervous and we went to check out. But I really didn't need more than what I got. state of our new cabin at this current moment just arriving back from getting packages and Walmart shopping we're gonna have to sort this one out it is um it's going to be a struggle navigating through this room but I do want to open my packages with you and also give you a haul of what I got at Walmart I pulled out the big tripod for for this process so I'm going to start unpacking. I'm going to just focus on getting everything out of the luggage and tucking the luggage away. I'm going to deal with like the organization and logistics of my closet afterwards and organizing as well. I feel like that is the least important thing to do right now.
I have emptied both of these luggages as well as my pink one. Pink one is already under the bed. I just placed the smaller suitcase into the larger one and I don't know if I'm going to fit it under the bed or maybe in the dressing room, like in my cubby. So on the older ships, there is just space all the way under the bed. But on Wonder, they have these little like storage cubes, if you will, which is great because you have more places to store your things. However, it takes up quite a bit of space for luggage. So that is the problem we are, we are facing. I did put all of my like snacks in this little cubby. So my protein bars, peanut butter, uh, Tupperware, my greens, some emergency hot sauce, obviously. So all of that is under there. I think we're at a good enough place where I can show you everything I've got from Walmart. Um, I didn't go too crazy, so a little pat on the back to me. First thing I got is a pack of two beach towels. So Midori and I are just gonna split these because I just really wanted a beach towel for the contract. Of course, we need a little room decor. So I got this cute little canvas. Uh, another memory card. I got a little travel tumbler. It was literally a dollar for coffee. Some gum, some string lights. They are battery operated. So I do need to get batteries for that. Two packs of mini elastics for show hair. I got some almonds. I don't remember what contract it was on. I think it was on Adventure, but I had these little storage cubes for the closet and they were game changers. I wanted to get like a cheap body mist for like show days. A $1 water bottle because I need a water bottle stage left and right during the show because it's, uh, it's intense. I really needed a cute mug for the cabin so I got this one. It's like iridescent. Then I got a women's multivitamin gummy because I love a gummy. SPF 30 sunscreen essential. Then I got this little storage container. I haven't yet decided where I'm going to put it. And then finally my last purchase from Walmart was a pillow because the pillows on the ship, if you know, you know. Many hours later. We've settled in. We are home sweet home. I honestly don't know what, what our room number is. I can't remember, but it doesn't matter. We've made it here. I finally unpacked everything, all of my luggage. Um, made my bed, hung up some of my pictures behind me. I still have to print a few more, um, but it's a work in progress. Yeah, it feels really good to be settled into the room finally after three weeks of waiting. And it's cute. Yeah, I'm going to end the vlog. We have a really long day tomorrow. We have to start at like 8 a.m. and then I don't finish with work until about 11 p.m. And my back has seized up on me today, so that's a new, a new fun finding. <laughs> With install, it never ends, but we are at the home stretch. We're almost there. So I'm going to get some rest, and I will see you guys in the next vlog.